My prediction was right. But like, How about them Cowboys, like, Stephen A? Even like the Patriots don't lose like that. Yeah. They don't lose like that. Not because of the... There were things that happened yesterday mm -hmm. where if you played those games a thousand yep. times, that's the only time first it would happen. First of all, first of all, you're under the weather. Your voice is gone. So number one, don't He's be trying to, don't 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 talk but so much. And number two, don't even annoy me. Don't even start. And don't ooh today. Why? I'm you're not, so let wrong? me tell you something right now. Oh, Are oh you please. Mad oh about really? It? Am I wrong? We can get it on. Y'all make ooh. Can we just talk about go. it? Let's, Let's just go, man. Let's just go. Let's just go. Didn't I tell you not to talk too much? Save I your voice, you were man. Doing dramatic Save your voice, you, man. You, uh, Save this your weekend. voice. You lost your voice. You I get know it. what it's like to come to work. Mm -hmm. And you're basically in a shouting match with Stephen A. Smith, yeah. and your voice is shot. Mm. It's like that dream you go to school. You know school, what it's great school, for? My hearing. hearing. First of all, first, first of all, first of all I'm not always shouting. I'm not always sad. Sometimes I could be mellow. Sometimes I could be hurt. I have emotions. I have yeah. feelings too. Okay. <laughs> I didn't mean okay. To hurt them. This is really ridiculous, though. I'm really ticked. I was having mm. a wonderful weekend, a beautiful weekend, and. And then that robbery right. took place last night. Let's just get Let's into go. it. Oh, we, don't Let's need, go. we don't need to do any scripts or anything. You think the Eagles got robbed? Hell yes. How? Hell Stephen yes. A? First of all, let's understand something here. The first and near the last play of the game, not the last play of the game, obviously, mm -hmm. we got it. And that touchdown that wasn't a touchdown for some offensive pass interference. One of the most bogus calls a lot I've of seen this season. Happening. It just it just made me sick to my stomach. Here's the deal, Mollywood. I told you, more so than Max, I told you. I said the Dallas Cowboys are allergic to prosperity. Everybody's been bloviating about them. They beat the New Orleans Saints. They come out there and they ball last week. Yeah. What happens? I said now that everybody's been talking about them, the way that they've been talking about them, it's an NFC East division. I know they're the better teams. I know they should be favorite. I know they probably look better. I mean, Amari Cooper's a stud. We saw that. Wait, okay. I'm sorry. Did they win the NFC East yesterday? Let, let, Were they crowned the champions? Well, or that get, didn't I'll, happen? I'll get, don't make me answer oh, that question. Okay. Just, just we just start the show. Can I, can I warm up? Sure, can I warm, warm up. up. Get My up. point to you is I told y'all when you sit up there and you put them in an elevated position, they don't know how to act. All right. So had that call been made properly, mm -hmm. they would have been playing behind the eight ball. There wouldn't have been a nine to six lead at the end of three quarters. OK. And they would have been playing in a hole and they probably would have lost the damn game. You're damn right. I feel the Eagles got robbed. Those are two bogus calls that went against them. And both of them were pivotal because one was a touchdown and one could have led to a touchdown. No, no, they did not get robbed. Look, Stephen A., you're clearly right <coughs> about the first play. Not only were the Eagles the first to it, there was no cowboy in the vicinity. So they're like a bunch of Eagles on it, and the Eagles come up with the ball, yeah. and it doesn't go to them, and it leads to a score. I get it why an Eagles fan is upset. Did the Eagles have chances to win after that? Did the, were the Eagles in the game? The answer is yes. Why did they lose? Doug Peterson's play calling. He misses Reich. Maybe he misses DiFilippo, you know, more than people even realized at first. And, much, and the most important thing, the secondary is so banged up. Yeah. All Amari Cooper has to do is run in a straight line. Hey, I run fast. There's no one back there. That's why he had 52 daily fantasy points yesterday. <laughs> like, that's why if you drafted Amari Cooper for your fantasy team, you're sitting pretty today. Because that Eagle secondary can't stop anyone. That's what happened yesterday. The Cowboys are playing championship defense. They got a great running back. Championship. That, they didn't play championship defense in that fourth quarter. Championship they, they are playing, defense. They are playing elite defense. They have a, they have a great running back. They drafted a, or they traded, which that trade's looking better and better for a legit number one receiver. They're, they don't have a quarterback. I'm sorry. Dak was missing throws all over the field. He is not good. He has regressed. I don't know if he's the answer for this team. But the fact is the Eagles had chances to win, and they didn't, and it wasn't because of blown calls. There were blown calls. By the way, even the, the, uh, 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 the call against uh, Goddard, the, the, yeah, I mean, was, what, Goddard the, the, w was a terrible call. That's a, t it's a non- Look like, at this. This is Offensive a, pass in the field. You got to be kidding me. That, that was a terrible call. Hmm. Even that didn't decide the game, Stephen A. That's not where the game was decided. The game was decided with a banged up secondary. Let's not be literal about it. Of course, there are plays that take place in between the action. Yeah. We get all of that. That play was at the end of the game right there. 
uh, it would have tied the score. They eventually went down the field and tied the score anyway with Darren Sproles' touchdown. We get all of that. What I'm trying to say to you is that take into account what I'm talking about when we're talking about the Dallas Cowboys. When you have the odds stacked against them, when you give them no chance mm -hmm. and they've got nothing to lose and they're playing with house money, they're monsters. They come at you. But when you say to them, you have arrived, when you say to them, you're the favorite, when there's expectations that's placed on their shoulders, the pressure mounts. And when the pressure mounts, this team historically hasn't been able to handle it when it counts. And in recent memory, I'm talking about. So I'm looking at it. I'm taking all of those things into consideration coming into Sunday's game. I'm saying the Eagles are the ones that got everything. I mean, the Dallas Cowboys have everything to lose. The Eagles, nobody's expecting them this year. They got 10 guys that on the defensive side of the ball that are injured, four in their secondary. Offensively, people are alluding to Wentz not being 100% healthy. You know that your running game in terms of a giant got moved out of there. Uh, uh, LeGarrett Blunt, I'm sorry, he got hurt. LeGarrett Blunt was moved mm -hmm. in the offseason. Clement hasn't been there, obviously. Smallwood's another matter. So you got Josh Adams that you just in inserted into the action a few weeks ago. Everywhere you turn, the Eagles have issues. The offensive line, as good as it is, Stephen isn't a, as formidable. Nobody's counting them out. You're lying. They're the defending champs. Did you I'm just accuse me out. of lying on national yeah. television? counting them no out. One's can, you can't say I, people are I, counting I, the Eagles did you just out. Me when they're on the, national television? I did. Okay. All right. Now, I want everybody <laughs> to understand, she instigated it. She started it. Oh, God. So when I get at her, I'm I don't want to hear nothing. I'm she not just called me a liar on national television. Stephen A., okay. you can't say people are counting them out when they're the defending Molly, wait, champs. Molly, Molly, I am sitting here yeah. counting them okay. out. Yes. I counted them out. But I'm saying out. all season. You can't, you can't I, say that. I counted them out when season? they lost their second back, not back to back, but their second consecutive home game with mm -hmm. that collapse against the Cowboys in the fourth quarter. When I saw that, you lose two home games like that. Okay, I know psychologically but I didn't count them out with either. The Super Bowl so nobody hangover. was lying about that. Nobody, I didn't count them out either because I had the Eagles. Remember, I kept saying the Eagles going to win this division. 